yoga and Ayurveda. These guides here to bring us back to ourselves, to our optimal health. They are maps that have certainly withstood the test of time. And so now we get to explore these maps in our lives today and begin to gain a broader perspective from the Ayurvedic end on how to properly care for this temple that is our body, from the yogic uh, uh, end on how to truly come closer to the essence, that spark of light that's within. So I invite you to join me on the mat on October 5th, 12 noon Eastern time. It's a hybrid class. You can plug in online from wherever you are or come into the studio. And for a couple of hours, we're going to play with asana, the yoga postures, which postures support you more based on your natural constitution, based on the environment that you're in. And then how to do those postures. Something as subtle as the gaze or the attitude with which you come into a posture will have an impact on the mind body. Pranayam. We go deeper into the nadis, working with prana. There's five pranas. When the pranas are moving properly in the body, <laughs> no matter what attempts to come in that does not belong, it will be spit out. Huh? It's rejected. Only that which supports you comes in. But the five pranas must be balanced in order for that to happen. So I hope to see you here for some Ayurveda yoga. And I wish you all the best in your day today. Namaste.